I have made $489,000 on DistroKey for the past 7 years of going into the music industry professionally and in this video, I will show you how I was able to do it and how you can do it too. So make sure you watch to the end, smash the like button, subscribe and let's dive into it. Okay, so for the sake of those that don't know what DistroKid is, DistroKid is a distribution platform that helps artists to distribute their music to Apple Music, Spotify and all the streaming platforms, right? So you go through DistroKid to make sure that your song is on these platforms. So to get your song on DistroKid, use the link on my description and you can actually get 7% discount on your first subscription and that is the first step. Okay, so if you are paying attention to the video right now, you actually see a screenshot of how much I was able to make on DistroKid. You know what I'm saying? For you to know that I know what I'm talking about, I'm not just capping. Okay, so the first step is how I was able to make $489,000 from DistroKid as an independent artist for the past 7 years. Okay, this is how I did it. For you to make money from your music that is on Spotify and Apple Music, you need streams right you need a lot of streams and you need people to buy your song on itunes and you need people to buy your song on amazon but the first step i took to make sure this is possible is that i sorted out a way to get myself into spotify and apple music editorial playlists and that is the only true way you can be able to do it you know what i'm saying because if you are not an early artist into these record labels you know who have built enough fan base you can't really be able to do it so the only way to do it is to make contact and know the people that handles this editorial playlist on these platforms right and some of these playlists has millions and millions of monthly listeners you know what i'm saying so i did it by going into the editorial playlist and the first step i took to get contact of these people that handles this editorial playlist is that I went through my mentor. You know what I'm saying? So as an artist, as an independent artist, you need a mentor who is an A-list artist. Through him or her, you can be able to get contacts. You know what I'm saying? The music industry and the music business is all about contact and the contact is always circulating as long as you are in that circle. So when I got the contact of these people that handles this editorial playlist, you know, I started building relationship with them, right? You have to build relationship. If not, you are going to pay a lot of money and end up lasting in the playlist for only 24 hours, right? So when I built relationship with them, you know, we started navigating on how to go about it and they really guided me. So we, we made a deal, right? We made a deal. If I got so so amount of streams, this is their percentage, right? I'm not trying to be greedy. It's all about deal. You know, if you go sign a record label deal, it's called record label deal for purpose because as a deal, you get your cut and the record label gets their cut. So now I'm making the deal as an independent artist with these people that handles this editorial playlist, right? I'm not talking about created playlists. Created playlists are those playlists that people created on their own. I'm talking about the playlist of the platform right the platform their own editorial playlist so that is how i was able to take the first step okay so the second step i took is to make sure that i was dropping new music every week you know what i'm saying this is very important because when you build those fan base through those playlists they come over to your artist page on spotify or apple music they are looking for more music to listen to you know what i'm saying so the playlist are going to bring them to your page and your page with enough music catalog they can be able to listen to as much music as possible you know what i'm saying so that is the way i was doing it i was dropping music every week you know new single every week and this is distro kid you know you only pay once and you can distribute music for the whole year you know what i'm saying so it made it possible for me to be you know dropping music every week and the most interesting thing is this some of these fans that i got from apple music editorial playlist we are buying songs on itunes right itunes owns apple music so they go and buy songs from their top you know artists when they drop albums so and itunes recommend them to my songs and i'm dropping four songs every month you know what i'm saying so I'm getting four dollars from them every month, you know, to buy one of my songs. So I get the money from them, you know, from one person. I get four dollars from one person every month, and they go ahead to stream my songs, and they are streaming four of my songs every month, plus you know the past songs that I have dropped. So if I have like uh 
50 songs that I have already dropped, like I'm getting 50 streams from one person on Apple Music every month or every day or every week. You know what I'm saying? So that is how it works. So when you build those catalog, you can be able to keep the streams going up and you can be able to utilize, you know, the opportunity of this editorial playlist to make sure that, you know, you're on your A game. You know what I'm saying? So those are the two ways I was able to do it. And I think this is the easiest way to make it happen. So right now, if you're an independent artist or an upcoming artist watching this video, I advise you to go get a mentor. You know what I'm saying? Get a mentor and start building relationship with your mentor and your mentor probably going to take you up to those meetings and, you know, give you those contacts that will elevate your career. You know what I'm saying? So even though you are looking for a record label or a good record label deal, you need a mentor as well. You know what I'm saying? Because your mentor probably knows everybody in the music industry. So they are going to take you hand in hand and introduce you to people that matters in the music industry. You know what I'm saying? So. DistroKid is like a wonderful platform, trust me, because, you know, it makes things easy for me as well. You know what I'm saying? They are not sponsoring the video, so I'm just doing it to show you what I was able to make on DistroKid. $489,000 in seven years. What do you think about it? Comment below. Tell me what you think about it. Does it worth it? $489,000. So even though I'm doing a day-to-day -day job, will I be able to make that amount of money in seven years? You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm asking. So I think that's a very good amount of money. You know what I'm saying? And we are just getting started. And don't forget to smash the like button, subscribe, and see you on the next video.